Hello Isopod fans and welcome to another episode of the Isopod blog. Today's special in that we have two different things that we're doing. I'm going to be feeding some bins of the Isopods and also have a special announcement. So stay tuned to the end. You won't want to miss this one. The Isopod blog. Let's go ahead and get started with feeding some bins. What I have here is some water, obviously to uh, increase the humidity of the bin if it needs it. I have eggshells for calcium, freshly ground. I have some fish food, and we feed the fish food maybe once every three or four feedings, just a, a little bit of a different balance in their foods. And for this feeding, I've got mushrooms. Now I'm using mushrooms that we collected about a month ago. I brought them home. I allowed them to dry out, but uh, in the process, they started to get a little bit soft. So, and that was after about a day or two. So we took the mushrooms, we threw them in the, the oven, we baked them, and uh, they came out real nice and, and crisp. I cut them up and they're ready to feed the isopods. Well, let's get going. I have a bin of uh, Porcelio Hoffman Segai. And uh, if you notice, I checked the top. Sometimes we get these isopods that will get a little bit higher in the enclosure and they'll stick to the top and I don't want to lose any isopods that way. So I'll get some close-ups of these and uh, as we feed them, I'm going to go ahead and throw in some uh, flake food. Throw in a couple of pieces of the mushroom. I check the, the uh, sphagnum moss for moisture just to make sure everything's okay there. I'm going to add just a little bit of a misting. I don't do much for these uh, Hoffman Segai. And I'm going to go ahead and grab some uh, some eggshells. And I'll throw in just a bit at, a, at the side so I can tell where I fed them and I can monitor that for every feeding. And it looks like we're all set. Let's grab the next batch. This is Porcelio spatulatus. Same routine, open up the top, get a little bit of the flake food, feeding in a couple of different areas for these guys. Looks like they have the eggshells, so we're okay there. I'm gonna grab a piece of mushroom. I'll add a little bit of moisture, but just to the sphagnum moss. For these spatulatus, I don't really like spraying the whole uh, enclosure. And we're all set. Let's go ahead and feed these uh, Porcelio Scaber Koi. This is a group that we got about, I would say a month ago. They came in real nice. Um, we're starting to get some babies for these. The interesting thing about these Koi is that it takes a little bit of work with them to get that orange color coming out. Everything looks good. I'm gonna spray them down just a little bit and we're all set. So I'm going to go ahead and finish feeding this rack, but uh, rather than you watching through that whole feeding process, let's go ahead and uh, get right to the announcement. Thank you for waiting until the end of the video to watch this special announcement. We've been doing the Xpod vlog now for 11 episodes. We're just kicking this thing off, but I'm having a lot of fun with it. And we're getting a really, really good response from everybody, uh, from the viewers, from Facebook, from uh, Instagram. Everybody's putting in some really good comments about the uh, Isopod vlog. So I wanted to stop for just a second and show some appreciation to everybody that's supporting this special offer. So to celebrate the success of the Isopod vlog, I'm going to go ahead and do a giveaway of some Isopods. This is your choice of three different isopods. I'll list out the different isopods that are available in the description. The winner can go through and select the three that they want shipped to them. Free shipping, of course. All you need to do is select the three different isopods that you want sent to you. 
I've got a list of the rules. There are some rules here. What you must do is subscribe to the Supreme Gecko channel. Please hit that notify as well. Please like this video, this specific video. And most importantly, you must have a comment in this video. And the comment can be, pick me. That way I can identify those people that want to be in the giveaway as opposed to anybody that just wants to leave another comment, a helpful comment on the video. Again, this is only for this video. Leave a comment. Comments on Facebook or Instagram or other social media platforms won't be considered. I'm going to go ahead and pick a random winner and duplicate comments will be eliminated, but I'll pick a random winner on July 26th. That's not next video, but the video afterwards. Now this is for only people that put a comment in that live in the continental US only. Again, this is my way of showing appreciation to everybody that's shown so much support for the iSpod vlog to this point and moving forward. Remember, all that you need to do is subscribe, hit that notification, hit the, the like on this video, and most importantly, you must put a comment in. And that comment should be, pick me. Thank you for watching. Get those comments in and good luck everyone.